our goal is to find the mass of the orange and here's what, how you can find it over here and I'm going to put 50 gram over here and 50 gram I'm going to try to read the displacement if I do read the displacement I see 5 6 7 8 okay I see 8 centimeter uh, let me see again 5 6 7 8 I see 8 centimeter displacement okay so I'm going to write this one is 8 centimeter 8, eight centimeter displacement 8 centimeter displacement and this is 250 gram and I see that it is uh, 10 15 16 so 16 centimeter so I'm gonna go over here and I'm gonna write 16 centimeter the 100 one is 16 centimeter and this one was 500 gram I believe 500 gram let me take a look again this is uh, oh the other one is 50 gram and this is 100 gram so I was wrong the other one was 50 gram 50 gram 50 gram and this is 100 gram 100 gram so this indeed 0 0.05 kilogram 0 0.05 kilogram and this one 0 0.16 meter and 100 divided by 1000 would be 0 0.1 0 0.1 kilogram 0 0.5 times 9.8 okay 9.8 and 49 Newton okay and point 0.1 times 9.8 that would be 0.98 so this one would be 0.98 Newton okay so what are you gonna do with this we're gonna use the Hooke's law so what is Hooke's law tells us f is equal to kx what does that mean that means k is equal to f over x over x final minus x initial okay so k okay, f final we can say that this is 0 0.98 minus 0.49 and this one is uh, let's see um, 0.16 minus 0 0.08 all right so we can erase everything over here so let's see what we get so 0 0.98 minus 0 0.49 is 0.49 k is equal to 0.49 divided by 0.16 minus 0.08 is 0.08 so 0.49 divided by 0.08 would be 6.125 6.125 okay all right so i'm going to go over here i'm going to recheck okay so this look like okay uh 0.32 so i'm going to report 0.32 over here so 0.32 uh okay oh i already so 0 0.32 so i'm gonna write 0 0.32 uh, because uh 32 centimeter is 0 0.32 meters so that means f is uh, 6.125 times 0 0.32 is 1.96 1.96 newton so f equal to ma we want the mass so mass is f over a so m is f over g so f is 1.96 g is 9.8 so divide by 9.8 and that would be 0.2 mass is 0.2 kilogram so we want to convert it to the gram so mass is 0.2 kilogram well you don't have to convert it to the gram but you know if you really convert it to gram this would be 200 gram but that's not as a unit this unknown mass would be this one would be 200 gram or 200 gram or 0.2 kilogram free science lab to fall in love with math and science especially programming